Hi my friends, I'm Antonius and in uh, this video we will continue with our application. We will uh, make the, all the necessary code to, to see first if our database exists or needs update and if so we will uh, create or update it. First we must uh, make a text file and save it in internal storage for, for uh, first time use and then we will create the database but uh, we will make the code to search if the text uh, file exists we will check for the, the current level of the database to see if it is uh, the same with the, the previous and if it's not then we will update our database so let's start we will make the code in uh, splash class here so the first time that uh, when, when uh, our application starts to execute all the, the code that we need so here we will write the code three variables the two must be a string value this one is the first one the second one the second one a string update with a 0 1 the third one a boolean must update it's equal to false we must make our first method name it make the file as you see here and now we will create the method Eclipse will create the method for us and here we will write the code for our method. First we will set a string file name for our database. I name it update.ss you name it as you wish. Our uh, text file which we will use it to see if it's uh, the first time that we use the program or not. Now we need another variable string variable name jur it will be equal with uh, our update value and if you remember the update value we will give to our update value 0 1 so the 0 1 it will the jewel it will be equal to 0 1 for the first time then we need to use try because we will work with uh, internal storage we have to make a, a text file and then we will uh, create a variable file which it will be equal to get basis, uh, base context and get file stream path with a name file name the name or our file name is update.ss we need to import file here have to check the, if the file if this file exists so if file dot exists let's just show a toast toast message that's it we will make we have to import toast Alright, to ask this text exists if the file exists. Else, in bracket, enter. It means that file does not exist, so we must uh, update uh, our database and make a new uh, file. So the variable must update, uh, it will be equal to true and then we have to create the, the file text so we need a file output uh, string variable to create a file in uh, internal storage in, no, yes internal storage a file output string I name it false it's, be, it's equal to open file output a file name update SSL get base context and mode private all right 
you have to import file import stream and now we will use a false variable to write the data we need the variable due that we get bytes That's it. We use the, the variable jor, string variable jor, with uh, update. We remember that the update is 0, 01, our first level. This way, the file created in, uh, in internal storage. Now we have to close force. We continue with two cuts. We have two. Cuts one for file note exception, file not found exception. And the second one, uh, when we try to make the file with the IO exception, import both, use the ePrint stack trace. And I think we're ready with uh, the make file, make the file. Uh, method. You, we make a, a string update variable which is equal to 0, 01. A one uh, boolean variable must update equal to false when a program starts or in plus uh, class and then we make uh, a method make the file. This method uh, use the file name string with update.ss for our file app for our text file name contains the string uh, jur with uh, 0, 01 which is uh, the level of uh, our data base our program then we'll try to find if the file exists we make a variable file and we check here if file exists. If exists, we have a, a trust text and a trust message to show us to show you a, a message if exists. Else, if it doesn't exist, must update uh, our database and we create the text file text file contains the jewel which is 0, 1. Close the text file here after we make it and we try to catch any errors if uh, file not found and if uh, we have an IO exception. That's it for, uh, for this lesson. I hope you enjoy it. We will continue soon. Thank you. Have a nice day.